Of course, there are many factors, race, income, lifestyle, genetics, that determine how long we live. Ben Tracy in Los Angeles found a program that is helping people improve their chances of living longer. With 26 fast food outlets in just six square miles, Baldwin Park, California has never topped anyone's list of healthy cities. A healthy selection means anything that's on this area. Maria so. Gonzalez is borderline diabetic. Her daughter Connie was headed towards the same future. And I feel guilty about it, but we did eat nothing but fast food before. But now that we started with this organization, we, we just started seeing that there is other options. A group called Healthy Kids Healthy Communities is helping its city pull away from its unhealthy past, despite its low income. Nearly 20% here live in poverty. Local residents got corner grocers to stock more fresh produce. Maria helped put up these signs that may seem obvious to some. It's not obvious because we're not used to reading labels. The group also helped pressure Baldwin Park to ban new drive throughs Not a single new fast food restaurant has opened downtown in five years and school kids now get 100 minutes of exercise each week. The results? A 13% drop in overweight children in Baldwin Park. And some experts believe that Hispanic populations, like in Baldwin Park, live longer in part because of their close social networks. I think we've been very successful. I think in communities where you don't have a lot of healthy choices, you really have to work with what you have. And, um, and that means working with your little corner stores. It's not just about the food parents buy to bring home and feed their kids. It's also about what their kids are eating while they're at school. This week, Los Angeles County, which includes Baldwin Park, banned chicken nuggets, corn dogs, and flavored milk in its public schools. Here's why. Just one cup of chocolate low-fat milk has 158 calories and 25 grams of sugar. It's just like drinking a cup of Coke. Do you feel good about what you've accomplished? Yes. And now Maria yes. Gonzalez knows her children have a better diet all day long that will hopefully help them live longer. Ben Tracy, CBS News, Baldwin Park, California. So if life expectancy is declining in some places, we wondered how the country is doing overall. We checked today with the Centers for Disease Control, and they told us life expectancy has never been higher nationwide. American men, on average, can expect to live 75.7 years. Women... 80.6 years.